To create the plate for my first weldment, I want to work in the front construction plane. So first, I'll select the front construction plane. Notice I've already told it I'm creating a weldment. And then I'll select Extrude Boss Base. Next, I want to make a rectangle. So I'll select the two-point rectangle. And I'll click here, move up and over, click, and I'll press Escape to stop creating rectangles. I want my origin on the midpoint of this line, so I'm going to right click on the line and select the midpoint. I'm going to hold Control, select the origin, and I'll make these two coincident. Next I'll use my mouse gestures to activate Smart Dimension, and I'll add the height of 4 space 3 slash 16. Then I'll select the bottom or top line, move down and click, and I'll add the 6.5 inch dimension. This is fully defined, so I'm going to right click and I'm going to exit my sketch. Then I'll set my thickness to 3 8 I'll press enter to accept that and select OK to create the plate. I also want to view this, shade it with edges. The next thing I want to do is I want to fill at these corners. So I'm going to select this corner, then I'll select fill it. Notice how the fillet size is highlighted in blue. So I'm going to enter the size as three quarters and push enter to apply it. And then I'm going to add a fillet to this part edge. I'll just rotate around a bit. I'll select that edge. I'll right click and accept that. The last thing I want to do is I'm going to select this face. I'll look normal to it. And I want to add four hole wizard holes. So I'll select hole wizard. In the hole specification, I'll tell it it's a drilled hole. Working an inch, I'll look for fractional drill sizes, and I want this hole to be 1732. So I'll select 1732. I'm not going to turn on any countersinks. I want it to go through all. Next, I can select the position. And I want one at the center of this radius. And I want another one at the center of this radius. So I'll hover over the radius to wake up its center. Then I'll add two more holes down here. Press escape to stop creating center points. I'll select this circle and this circle and I'll make the relationship vertical. I'll do the same for these two points. Then I'll make these two horizontal. Again, I'll use mouse gestures to activate smart dimension. And I'll dimension these up three quarters of an inch. My holes are fully defined. I'm going to exit the sketch. I'll look at it isometrically and save my part and I've now created the first plate for my first weldment.